that's how that works. The entire venue will yell so loud that you can't hear yourself think. Okay, okay. <laughs> we do like our hype. We do like hype. We do like hype. But and that's sometimes this is gonna be a very, very quintessential SoCal matchup here. And so what is Monte looking for in this matchup, PJ? Uh, in the matchup like this, of course he wants to get those uh, big combos started with Nair. Try to catch Palutena on an approach option. Palutena is going to try to zone out Monty's approach options with those back and dash attacks, as well as he can versus a character like Damon Watch. Be very, very confident in your ability to grab Damon Watch, uh, get those free percentage points, especially because Monty is so reliant on those uppy out of shields. Okay, that down tilt. Oh wow, Chase was so patient. He knew that Monty was going to pick a panic option. Fly and wait throughout the other down tilt and then just. It has to be a line from that back here to stop. Monty is absolutely crazy. Uh, oh, sorry, Chase is playing absolutely amazing so far. All over, Monty not giving him an opportunity to even land. Every time Monty is picking a defensive option, he's getting met with 20 to 30 percent at the end of that battle chain violated by Chase. That's the upper the upper Monty trying to fight his way out of the corner, but he hasn't found a way to get in on Chase when he has the stage against Monty. That's the outro fair. That's a good trade for Chase because Monty gets sent back away. Monty finally will get back to ledge. Oh, Monty just a teleport. Okay, that, that so might be a game changer. Oh my god, what a conversion for Monty. That's a, that's a high rate reel. He uses that neutral B in a way so that even if he goes for a teleport, cancel land, it'll hit him there. And gets the conversion off of it. Sent up so he can keep with a down smash, Monty. Yeah, Chase right now is trying to tell Monty, you might get the highlight, but I get the victory. Dude, actually, just clean up. Chase is snapping back immediately, playing a very, very fundamental and like picture perfect way of fighting against Game Watch at Palutena. Showing some very good uh, matchup knowledge here. That's a very odd air dodge from Monty, but did give him a chance to reprieve a little bit. That's a movement in the dash attack work. No down hammers! And now he's just going to suffer from Palutena's excellent air game. He's going to rack up some, some mileage on Palutena and airlines. <laughs> Another freaking flyer. Is that right, PJ? Yeah, you can tell with a lot of yes, from these pilot players. Wow, both from the back of their into the stage back. Chase able to uh protect the oh, cave? I don't know how he hit that. That was really close. <laughs> oh no. Monty opted for one of those up smashes that he watched so fond of and Chase was ready to react. Oh, to go for a fourth match, maybe with one of <laughs> I want to see where Paul is figuring out a place to use it. Tilt is sorely underrated. Oh my gosh! And Chase just wasn't ready for Monty to get that up to the top legs. He's not able to get the attack. Now, oh my! Okay, here we go. Monty is such a ledge game. The two three he has to trick out away from him. Out of the reach of the back here. Monty doing such a good job. He's trying to die here. This game one is drawing to a close against Monty, but you can maybe figure out a way to turn the tide of this ledge trap. Can Chase escape? He gets the teleport past him. And now Chase has center stage. Let's see how he slow plays it here. Weaving through platform. It's on back there, but not enough to get the stop immediately, but it does give Chase full stage control, PJ. Chase is playing very well here against Monty, not really giving him an opportunity to get in, but now Monty has an opportunity. Gets a dash attack out of the corner, something that he talks about that he his gameplay. Down smash is letting it rip now 65% with all these raids. We'll definitely be able to take it. Oil kind of oh, well, Okay, well. Alright, <laughs> Monty was like, I don't need to hold on. JL, thank you for the bits, by the way. Yeah. Dude, he's trying to shark out a landing option uh, from Chase back at neck and neck. Dash stack sending away once again. You know what you, know what you feel about uh, Monty as dash stack as being a possible option? Oh my gosh, Monty trying to slow play the hammers, but instead he's going to eat that back here. Just catch his shield flick in between the, the, the shield being active. Good job by Chase, not to let Monty uh, put it back into that one. And uh, we're going to see Chase go up 1 0. Oh, Chase go up 1 0. Oh, Chase go up 1 0. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. We've had one hell of a day, one hell of a night here, PJ, at the Mind Play Gaming Center out here in Weird, California. Folks, if you just joined us, especially because we have our special guest, MT Leo, big boss in the house, thank you so much. Make sure to drop a follow. Make sure to stick around for more Smash Ultimate action. We're getting into game number two here between Chase and Monty. Yo. Thank you so much, Liquid 1290, with the prime sub. That means you have to use all the emotes on the channel and you get commercial free viewing on the channel. So. And all of those subs and all of the follows will help uh, be, will help with uh, supporting SoCal scene, supporting Mindplay Gaming to uh, help provide an excellent home for SoCal Smash. 
one or two back to PS2, I think. I don't know. I didn't see the stage, and I never really do. Here we go. Battlefield. A very interesting uh, choice to go to the stage um, versus Pilot Data, but I know Monty likes the stage in the matchup. Uh, now, oh, no grab there for Monty in the whip grab. They started to chase him now with the dash tag. Not quite going to work there. Fair, fair. Monty trying to get his ledge trap going. Chase almost got the landing explosive, but uh, Chase is probably the Palutena man in the world who's got the best handle on how to be very, uh, they have that nice touch with the explosive flame again, placed it exactly where he needs it often. I know what you feel about that, PJ. About what, I'm sorry? Oh, but uh, Chase explosive flame usage. Oh, yeah, it's really, really good uh, to catch the defensive option. But, uh, dude, Chase is playing this absolutely clinically. Uh, no expect nothing less from the number one uh, PR install. Oh, my God. And now platform capping, exactly what you should do when you have a lead against a floating character. I've been told that Battlefield is probably his best stage, so... As much as the comfort pit for Monty, those platform cancels allow the chase to mix up in all kinds of ways. Yeah, I, I think Monty's stage choices are very interesting a lot of the time, maybe even questionable in certain opportunities. And I feel like Chase is trying to discipline Monty here. Like, you're taking me to my best stage as Palutena, I'm going to punish you for it. Dash attack now, not even getting in on that uh, up smash, not trying to contest it, I'll just completely beat it out. You can see just how defensively Chase is playing this, because Monty's trying to lay out some faint options, some good options for center stage when he does hit center, and Chase barely bite takes the bait for it. Oh no, the teleport canceled. Monty was able to react to it in the back air work. Try to get a jump call out there in back air as well. Fair enough, that worked. Good defensive gameplay by, by Chase. Chase now recovering low, eats some of these fish. Chase like me. I was out of protein free diet, and Monty was like, "Eat up, buddy." That's a buffet there from Monty, giving him as much food as Chase can handle, and apparently he couldn't handle any more than that. Here's the um, buffet into the down air. Very good stuff from Monty here. There's a bread basket. Yeah, double up there. It's just out. That's how Palatina means make your money with that bread basket. Oh, the yeet factor. You always have to be careful with quartering Palatina sometimes we get too close. It's one of those really great ways to kind of check your opponent. You're saying, you know what? I don't believe in your ability to comfortably or safely pressure me. I'm going to punish you for it. Oh, uh, well, thanks, Primer. Can Marvin get the stop right here? Oh, oh my God. God. That would kill, too. Yeah. Yeah, I'll throw. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. wait there. Yeah. Good trade for Chase to be able to immediately get the game positioning. Oh. He whipped! He didn't. Ooh, trying to hit the two frame there. Monty not as consistent as he wants to be there. Another one? Uh, again. He's fairly missing these. And oh, look at the teleport cancel for Chase. You have a back air out before Monty could actually throw a hitbox where he thought he was going to be. Oh, and now Monty pouring himself into the corner. Gets the back air off stage. A little bit this looked very good for Chase earlier, but Monty is just strike for strike keeping up with him. Dude. It's a pro wrestling move with that chair there. That, the actionable frames of that move is so crazy. We're not actionable. The active frames of that move is absolutely ridiculous to cover those normal getups. Even at those like percents where you're at kill percent, the weak box will kill. It's crazy. Yeah. Uh, Try to chase to a corner right now. Monty named a dare. Double there. Like, Try the fish. Try the fish again. Try these. Oh, man. Ledge. At the ledge here, tries to go for the two frame. I really like that back air to the side. The after ledge gets the two frame there. Has the ledge once again. The end guard Monty needs to close it out. Oh, no. Great teleport angle. Monty able to panic his way back. Oh, no. Harry, did a hammer? Oh, no, Harry! Yeah, no, Harry! Chase trying to figure out a way back in. Monty got covering so much space with those spare bombs. You know how that move was bad at the start of the game. Dude, that move is absolutely ridiculous. And there's no budget on the uh, VFX there. Oh, man. Monty didn't blink. He got the grab there, but Chase immediately fired came back on stage, firing back the Nair. Whoa! Do I have to kill? That was funny. <laughs> funny bomb. Oh, there we go. That's what do it. Monty is on the board, baby. Monty's on the board. He's going to battlefield there, proving the dominance on his comfortable pick. Kind of a lesson there. If you're comfortable somewhere, you might as well go there, right? For all our, our, our finger pointing, that was a very strong performance from Monty Game 2. <laughs> I don't think it's a lot of the hurt, but it's a good thing. I'm wrong with you. It's a good thing. 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 It's a good th
Centralized platforms as well. An interesting choice, maybe once a fighter stage, Monty probably banned FD. If he likes Battlefield in the matchup, then he definitely banned FD. And this is a good, very SoCal pick. We're one of the only regions that has this stage uh, legal um, in some of, our, uh, some of our locals. We're trying to back your wife since that time now, but it doesn't really matter. Go right back to it. Oh, did a very down spot in Monty. Just lit him up. And the punishing chase for trying to touch him in the corner. Okay, here we go. Chase going for a ride. Watch may not fly, but he can swim with that fishbowl. Good air to fight. Monty put it. Wow. Far. It's right on the mark by Chase and the down frame. I like the recovery mix up for Monty there, too. Avoiding that down air. Actually, I'm setting off stage Monty, or sorry, Chase went for the teleport capture there to the attack. Monty slapping off stage, but Monty's not doing him anything. Goes for the Nair cross up on shield. Now doesn't have an out of shield option good enough to punish it. And Monty keeps pulling the trigger so early on oil panic. Dude, he's just probably confident about it. When you're talking about this yesterday, he's just going to go for whatever he can. The ass crap working out for Monty Stamer Watch. He's having a hard time getting his mitts on Chase earlier on the set. Well, oh, also Chase is the green version of Palatina. Oh, change colors. <laughs> well, I meant that, I meant that as the reason for the counter pick. Oh, it's harder to see. Him. Good, good, good. I feel like it's hard to see on this stage. Wow, it just vanished while we were taking a minute there. The Nair, uh, Nair lines, as you like to call it here. Yes, sir. Monty will finally escape. Now throw back there. Offstage, Monty trying to recover now. Chase hasn't taken any percent of this stock play very, very well, but there's a reverse system. And then, you see that Monty grab the one closer frame all the way from over there? Yeah. It's a very odd mechanic. Ooh, that was so good for Monty to face around that. Some crazy less traffic for Monty so far. That was a big one. He was getting some crazy traffic. Uh-oh, Devil was working with me. Boy, the second one, he points that Nair up there too. What the heck? Ah, he tried to strike it with the get-up attack, but Monty was ready. Explosive Flame has Monty on the roofs here on the second stock. Apparently avoiding that up smash too very two framing option. Here's the grab. Back to off stage. Has the edge guard now full for a bucket even catching in the game. He was anticipating the explosive play. Monte did a set of hammers at last, but Chase Anthony just passed. They threw safe. Eat the fire of the bomb is it went for gas back into the bear. There it is. Wow. Game? Uh, game? Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. I think it's comfortable here. Yeah. The stage is super pushed up the stage. I'm going outside. I'm going to try 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 to Leo got upset at a local. What happened there? Get it. Get the click here. Get everyone to watch this. If you're watching some of the best so crowd ultimate we have to offer. Um, love this scene. Love the players here. So it's very good to see them uh, on a stage and the platform like this. Now Monty uh, on this hollow back. Don't know why he took him here. I thought it was pretty good to take for Monty. <laughs> You watch a lot of popular extensions, but hey, maybe Chase is trying to find something that works. Chase is trying to get these strikes to land, but Monty was just holding firm in field. Panic at shield, but good job by Chase avoiding the fall. Chase did a really good job, it's not getting caught up like you watch the up airs. You have to be that in order to keep yourself in the game. Dude, Monty's just barely off on his spacing with the down smashes, which is giving Chase another opportunity to live. Chase getting a little bit mad there on the player cam. The area to catch Chase and Awareness, but Chase is not landing back here. Dude, he's all over him. I feel like he's kind of adapted to the game. Possibly, but 
Jay still has the wherewithal to fix it up, but he's getting mad though. Oh, he never, well, I mean, here's the thing. Jay's is definitely the, the, the caliber of player to figure out a way to get back into this one. Ah, oh, man, he thought he was able to defensively work against it, yeah, but the back here caught him. They're off the ledge, very good option from Chase. Keeping Monty at bay on the ledge, that ledge trap is so crucial for Monty. 177%, a forwarder might still center stage, a backer might at the ledge. Monty's trying to get that grab that's usually over-reliable for David Watch, but instead, Chase firing out. Data, it's supposed to play the land. And it's, oh, he needs the backer to get off the land. <laughs> Chase starting out deep, but Monty going down low, excellent recovery. Over extended on Jack Jack, Chase Man Pay. Off stage again, and Monty back. Oh, he was fighting for the next grab. Monty, I didn't even know that was a fast enough to get away from the cut off, right? So, hey, Aaron, how's it going, bro? Good. So, swinging at these backers that Monty has an opportunity to head out the stock. That explosive plane is going to set up into a pretty good spot, but the gentleman Jack does kill it. And Monty knew that percentage range was going to work. Dude, that was crazy, dude. He's playing very, very well off the ledge here. Monty just has to figure out a way to just make this a war of attrition for Chase. Because, you know, eventually, just going to give a deal watch his weight. Chase is probably going to get the killing blow on this. For the stock, but eh, yeah. accurate sit. <laughs> yeah, there you go. The killing blow that Bash Attack able to take it here. Chase now. He's trying to use his fire air speed to get around people watch the options, but Monty's placed himself so well. He's doing a really good job of anticipating Chase's ledge mix ups and options. Then airs that catch Chase again. Can Chase land? Well, for the Nether, but he didn't guard. He saw that, he, Monty saw that air coming, he was like, I'm gonna get out of the way of this. <laughs> oh no, he has these. Oh, that's, what? Dude, oh, gosh, that is exactly what happened at San Diego. Yeah, and now Chase has an opportunity to, to get ahead here and just kind of pull away. Monty has to figure out how to fight back right now. I a big mistake cost him a stop. Gets it down here. Dude, this is a big make or break moment for Monty. This fair dash tech for Chase. He tried to have the back air land, but Monty was able to chase the handle dash tech itself. Gets a down air there, setting up high. I'm trying to catch him on the landing option here. I mean, the, the problem is that Monty's gotten so much mileage out of like just kind of like this, like, uh, the fish off approach here, but he has to actually threaten against Chase with a uh, behind a stop like this. Dude, this is crazy. Mon is still trying to work it out. Chase, uh, Chase's survivability is absolutely amazing here. Monty wants to kill, and it's really showing 195% is too high to be against Damon Watch. Yeah, and he's, he's maybe the more happy kill hitbox that Monty's had. Monty just can't even get the key to get the kill either. Wow, uh, barely able to DI out there. Tries to oh, nice. Okay, finally. Yeah, there we go. Make or break moment here for the life of Chase's tournament run here at MPG. Chase off stage. Monte with those meats out, trying to anticipate Chase with a much more aggressive lens recovery. Double nair, triple nair. Tries to go for the high up there. Chase able to get back to the small. Oh, no. no. Catching it out of lane. Now Monty trying to recovery. Rolls through. Chase not ready to cover that option. Committing for an out of normal guy, but doesn't find the active hitbox there. And Chase not ready to give up the set. He's doing everything he can. Again, Monty ready for the, the elite smash roll behind grab. Do that. Gonna have to be a little bit more tricky than that to get Monty. Monty not gonna let him in the spot. Both showed up in time. I feel like this is a little bit of a trick box to be. Ah, man. The chase is ready for Monty to run in and try oil panic. Yeah. Five folks. Big SD from for Monty was costly as hell. Oh my gosh. Playoffs and losers finals. So stay tuned. We'll be getting there very shortly. If you want to follow along on bracket, feel, feel free to hit exclamation point bracket in the chat. This is a crazy set. Big <laughs> back and forth now between these two. Are you sure? I'm pretty sure they're like all the stages are on the rule set. Maybe, maybe. Yeah, maybe Northern Game is it? Potentially, I'm not sure. 
I don't care. See? <laughs> what? What? No! That's a time! That was a while ago, Trey. No, dude, that was like seven, six months ago. Yeah. Four or five months ago. Literally five months ago. <laughs> Alright, game number five. It's all down to this, PJ. It's all down to this, folks. Pull all the marbles. Pull the Bastion. Here we go. Chase uh, advocates there, Sage immediately, and then his face makes Bonnie Bonnie pay for his friend and post to him. Ah, good spacing by Chase to avoid the oil pack and then punish Monty for drift out landing. Monty now took over the driver, took over the wheel, trying to get the blows like Oh my gosh, that plank actually stalled Monty in the air, pretty played up for Chase. Yeah, positioning. I feel like this is Chase's game to lose now. He got so much control off of that SC for Monty, and now he just needs to close it out. Monty's going to try his best to keep it as close as possible. Gets the corner there. High back, you're not going to be able to hit the up tilt. Here we go. I'm sure we can see it like a Good night, that's this. Oh, both of the there. Wasn't able to find it there. These bangers now on Monty's field, raining out, trying to find a way to edge out a stock. Dude, this is such a close set. Yeah, it's a carry, but no punch to how safely stunned there. On space, that bender is. It's a change of set. Monty right now just. Uh, it definitely feels like a replay of getting the game right now, Peach. Dude, it really feels like it, but Monty going to try his best to swing it back into his favor. He needs to find this kill, though. Chase's survivability versus this Game & Watch has been absolutely amazing, living to plus 150%. Look how well Chase is threatening Monty in space, too. And, uh, when, when Chase is on it, it just shows why he's going so cal. Yeah. That air to fair to dash to that excellent conversion from Chase. Oh no, it's not even over, PJ, but okay, Monty's got full bucket. Can he use it? Can he even get the bucket out? Can this man get his bucket out? Oh, no. He's still stuck at legs. This win for Monty. That is no up. Chase was like, yeah, you're gonna try to stay in my dress. No way, it's regal. The setting off stage to see what the option is here. Down tilt's trying to catch Monty on the recovery once again. Maybe a two frame, maybe a conversion any way he can. Back there, setting off stage 133%. Oh, wow, he's helping right by him. Back there's out, face now. Just looking to secure this, but wow, well, well, panic in. Whoa, he actually floated in using the added momentum of the back air to get past the explosive flame. Okay, Monty. Trying to figure out a way to get the stock off the chase. Ooh, high back here, they're going to be able to take it. Okay. 20% though on Monty is super fragile percent for Game and Watch. Yeah, you see that Chase has stopped going for the, the meme mutual gap reads. Last off situation for Monty for all the marbles. Oh, man. And there is building up damage. Hey, Burn, how's it going, bro? Back here from, uh, from Monty. Trying to ward off Chase, but Chase immediately right back into it. He's not even going. He doesn't even blink. He doesn't even say, all right, cool, in their time. That was a really good teleport after that from Chase. It's to get away from Monty. Just a bit, dude. Getting this ahead, bro. Oh, no. Monty on his last slide. So you're about to let Chase recover. Oh, no. There we go. There's what Chase is looking for the whole time. Yeah, Monty's getting desperate going for this air from ledge, and Chase is playing around him really well. Playing with Monty over the big boss's carry. Late air, back air, okay, okay, Monty. He's not out of it yet. Ah, but good teleport, he had past the fair. How deep? Can Monty survive? It's an air drift. Hey, it avoids the grab. Oh, 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 there we go. Not enough knockback on that oil panic. No doubt. Two for the hammers either. Monty just trying to pull out the kitchen seat right now. And it's not going to be enough. Chase says, go remodel elsewhere. I'm moving on. Situation that happened in San Diego. 
Yeah. Chase. Escape me with that. 